Today we're making a char siu chicken, an easy roasted chicken marinated to savory, sweet, sticky perfection. This is one of my favorite oven roasted chicken recipes of all time. So yeah, let's go. First, let's prepare the marinade for the chicken. I'm using a bowl here. You can also use uh, Ziploc bags. Add 1 tablespoon of light soy sauce, 1 tablespoon of oyster sauce, 1 tablespoon of duck soy sauce, you can also use ketchup manis or sweet soy sauce. And for the sticky and sweet in the char siu, we are adding a tablespoon of honey, as well as 2 tablespoons of brown sugar. To that, we're adding a teaspoon of Chinese Five Spice Powder and half a teaspoon of white pepper. This is one tablespoon of a blended ginger and garlic paste. It's basically equal amounts of garlic to ginger, so about two cloves of garlic to about an inch of ginger. If you buy char siu from the shops, it has this characteristic attractive red color. So I'm also adding red food coloring to mine, but this is totally optional, okay? I usually do not add the extra food coloring to this. Anyway, give all of that a nice mix. And then we're ready to add our chicken. I have about 300 grams of boneless chicken legs here. You can also use chicken thighs. I find using these parts of the chicken a lot more forgiving in the oven than using chicken breasts which can tend to dry out. But you can use it if you like, of course. Get the marinade all over the chicken, massage it in and you want to make sure that the chicken is submerged in the marinade. And then we leave these to marinate in the fridge for at least 2 hours or overnight would be the best. Okay and now we're ready to roast it. Prepare your pan first. Now I highly recommend that whatever pan you use to line it with aluminium foil. Now the chicken marinade is going to get really thick and sticky in the oven so this is really going to help with the cleanup. Then pop this in a preheated oven of 200 degrees celsius for about 15 to 20 minutes. Meanwhile, don't throw away the leftover marinade. We are going to be adding all of this to a saucepan and heat it up over low heat. Get it all nice and bubbly and thick like this. And this is your char siu sauce. Use this as dipping sauce for your char siu chicken later or just drizzle this over the rice. Mm. Anyway, about 20 minutes later and voila! Our char siu chicken is done. My favorite way of eating char siu chicken is with chicken rice. So the link to that somewhere here or down below. And yeah, we're done. So give this sweet, sticky, savory chicken a go. It's so easy and takes no time to prepare if you don't count the marinating time. And yeah, try it. Bye!